Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. And I just got done watching Ibo Aslan vs. Anton Turkerli. Uh The organization where they fought Brave, I think it's called. I thought PFL commentary was awful. I thought that uh, production was shit. Oh, oh, Brave is even fucking worse. What a piece of shit. I'm sorry to be so negative, but that's that shit's awful. And also, Ibo was absolutely de destroying Anton. Wasn't even a close fight in the slightest. And then Ibo uh, fucking stumbles off of a missed leg kick that he threw. He gets his back taken because he's tired in the second round and gets rear naked choked. Oh, you know who's going to win this matchup? Ibo. Because his cardio is better. Because he's a better striker. The pleasure man, hey... Pleasure the fans with you fucking losing. How about that? Your stupid ass press conference when with in from in your last one from against Pedro, uh, fucking uh, Tyson Pedro. You've lost three in a row. I get it. You took it on short notice against Johnson Almeida. Congratulations. You you lost against Vitor Petrino. Okay, sure. And then you get destroyed by Tyson Pedro, who's not good. That's a bit of an issue. Ivo Oslin, 12 and 1, 4 and 1 in his last five fights. The one loss is against Anton when they're both 4 and 0. Oh. Eight fight winning streak for Ivo. Coming off the contender series against Paul uh, Paulo Renato Jr. Again, much different fighter now is Ibo. 27 years old, 6'3 with a 77 and a half inch reach. Fighting Anton Turkley, 8 and 3, 2 and 3 in his last five fights on a three fight losing streak. Though, though, has fought some good opponents. 27 years old, 6'4", with a 78-inch reach. One inch in height, half inch in reach. Ibo Aslan by whatever he wants in this one. Probably by finish with the strikes. But as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment, and let me know who you're picking. See you at the next one. Peace.